Oh. Um, I don't think that when you build up the hype, you build up the hype by, back then, when we, our first place, we built up the hype by promoters. But even the promoters we used were not your conventional promoters back then, because uh, those guys wouldn't work with us. They didn't really like Iranians back then. And we're, you know, the guy that brought me that deal, he was Persian, I was Persian. They thought it was going to be a big Persian club. There's nothing wrong with, but that wasn't the intention. It ultimately ended up not being. And the people that didn't work with us ultimately, um, we bought their company. Um, uh, <laughs> so, I mean, it's, end of the day, I think, you know, you're going to get people to come to your place once in that business. Getting them to come the second time is usually the challenge. And do you get, you know, again, do you make mistakes, but, you know, you really have to, you have to, you have to know the business. I mean, a lot of people get in the nightlife business for completely the wrong reasons. They don't get in the nightlife business to get, make money. They get in the night, nightlife business to kind of address some of the things she was talking about was really enjoying the business. And we're in the business to make money um, and deliver an experience to our clients and deliver something that they can't necessarily get or level of, whether it's table side mixology that we introduced or whether it be really, you know, a level of service and a kind of cross marketing and pollinization that we do. Um, I mean, are there better nightclubs at one time or the other than we are right now? Do we have the hottest clubs right particular now? No, but we will again. And, you know, we have new clubs that are opening up soon. Again, that business. But um, it's, you know, a lot of it is promoter-based, but a lot, of, a lot of club owners, they let the promoters run their club. They just say, here's 30% of the door, blah, blah, blah. And, you know, when we got in, here's, you know, here's this, here's that, do whatever you want to do. They just want to have one peak night so they can live off the other four or five nights. We do things a little differently. We have a lot more, um, we have a lot firmer grasp and a lot of firmer hold than our promoters. And we tell them, if you want to be here, you know, work with us. Here's, this is what we're going to pay you. And if not, go work for somebody else. You have five, six month shelf life. So our checks don't bounce. Um, and you know, you know that at you know, the end of the day, when you see the numbers, we're not you know, skimming off the top. So in that business, I think we have a pretty good track record. It took six years to get there. And with a lot of mistakes on the way.